Oh, don't you love them? You're going to love this next story, too. Every once in a while, you run into a high school athlete that you do a feature on that you'll never forget. Tonight is one of them. With the help of photographer Randy Schwankert, we give you an inside look at the life of Molly Katzman. Sports Plus Spotlight is sponsored by AAA Auto Insurance. Hi, everybody. Happy Monday. Nice! You are looking at Ladue High School's most outgoing student, Molly Katzman. Hey, sister. <laughs> I go into Schnooks, and I can be with her, and we can go up and down an aisle, and four different people will say hello to her. I have no clue who they are. It doesn't matter where Molly goes. We're walking down a street, and she says, happy Friday to a stranger. I missed you, Riley. She just brings the energy everywhere. You can't go anywhere without hearing her cheering you on. Hey, Lucy, I missed you all weekend, hey. Molly is as busy as you can be. When she's not playing field hockey, then she's cheerleading at halftime of the football games as part of the Sparkle Group. It's been a great year for me, but it's been a great year to have fun. Molly was born 18 years ago with Fragile X Syndrome. It's a genetic mutation of the X chromosome. It's estimated to occur in 0.9% of 10,000 females. It causes learning disabilities and social and behavior issues. It's heartbreaking. You, you have a grieving process. You have, um, you know, there's a sense of loss and you just do everything you can to give your kid the opportunities that a typical kid would have. I really didn't feel anger when I heard the news. I felt more, um, what can we do to solve it? You know, there's some PTSD going on. There's a lot of years of uh, therapy, of, you know, therapists in and, in and out of my house every day of the week, hours upon hours. And As we got older, it was, it became obvious that you know, you, you, you work with it and you do the best you can um, with the resources that you have. One resource the Katzmans used was their oldest daughter, Lily, a star field hockey player, John Burroughs and Northwestern. And Molly never missed a game. And that's where she developed the love and everybody embracing Molly at games and letting her cheer on Burroughs and letting her cheer at Northwestern after their games and bringing her stick to every single game. There's no question, Molly knows her sports and our area high schools. To test your knowledge of nicknames. <laughs> Villa Duchesne. Saints. M-I-C-D-S. Rounds. Ladue. Ladue Rounds. Very good. What was great happened on September 9th. Coach Lindsey Porter at Ladue had an idea before their big game. My goal is to get Molly in as much as we can her senior year, um, and I'd asked ask the head coach at Villa if we could get her in that fourth quarter, and Kate said to me, what about getting her a goal? And it happened. One of the highlights of my high school career. It was, uh, it was very emotional, and uh, to see, just to see the kids' reaction for me was, was so special. Um, you know, it's something I'll never forget. I had chills the whole time while she was putting that ball in the net, um, and just to see the joy on her face, the girls on Villa's face, my girls, like, it was just such a special moment that it's, it's just unreal. In the car ride home, she said, Dad, I want to do that again. So I looked at her and I said, you do? And she said, yes, I do. Can we do that next game? Will you score another goal this year, Molly? Yes, I am. <laughs> Molly Katzman, the cheerleader, the field hockey star, but mostly the kid who just loves life. The blessing of, Mile is, uh, of, of Molly is her positivity. She's always happy. There's a lot of smiling that goes on around Molly. 